I wear this Yankees hat because my parents um, want me to wear it. And um, anyway, there are no Red Sox souvenirs here. So um, I'll just put a Yankees hat on and not tell anyone about it. My, my name is Aditya Ponder. Um, that's double A D I T Y A, and then space P O N D A. You can also call me A P. I moved from um, India to Singapore when I was three, and then moved to the U United States when I was thirteen because I had a learning learning disability and. The schools in Singapore did not understand the type of learning disability that I had, so I moved to the U.S. I've lost a lot of friends now seeking absolution. They want to grab my coattail and see that I'm proving I'm not your average child on grass from this rap illusion. You won't hear me ramble across like Gary Newman. Obstacles coming my way, hammer through them. You got the town on your back, well it's amusing. Part-time battler, don't flop, that's a movement. I've opened many doors as cocky little student. If you don't know me by now, you should uh, learn Learning disability go home is um, something that um, you have a lack in, or uh, like you're disorganized, for example, or you're, um, you have low social skills, you lack skills. Or like um, sometimes people um, are like, they don't know when to talk or when to start talking. They do awkward stuff sometimes, but in their mind they're smart. But they don't know how to use their smartness in some ways. In Singapore, it was terrible. Um, there were no tutoring services or um, help in academics. And um, in Illinois, there were no like um, there was less structure but more rules more restrictions more of everything but now it's like I'm free and I, I learned with that so yeah IEP programs are um, programs for people with disabilities and it helps um, these type of kids, well, with academics, um, helps them um, be um, prepared for college life, um, helps um, them by uh, giving them para professionals who um, sometimes go around, follow them, um, guide them to the classes or take notes from the, for, for them, yeah, take notes for, for them and um, record the class, uh, classes work, um, print out handouts, give you extra handouts so you can take home. <coughs> yeah, so what it usually does. IP programs, like, how does, do you think IP programs are beneficial? Um, actually, I think um, IE programs are beneficial because without this program, I wouldn't really be here right now, so. Um, the medication gave me a bounce. It used to, um, like, like some of the medicines actually um, created, created um, me to do odd, odd things like um, wake up at 4 a.m., just walk around the place and then uh, sleep back. Sometimes, um, sometimes even uh, stay up all night doing nothing. How is your life now 
uh, with our medication, it's a lot happier. It's um, I'm learning things often. Um, well, it's, I feel great with our medication, without having other problems in my life. Yeah, that's my first freestyle. The second one is uh, called Reborn. It's well, it's about me um, here. Yeah, I can't be reborn, but I can tell you about the struggles I once had before when I broke my bonds, got myself together, and just moved on. When the old me went in one direction and the new me came along, telling my story, telling my life's worth, important facts, both exciting and true point where it really hurts. In middle school, I used to get pushed around often. I used to pray to God that I didn't want to live often. At that time, I didn't want to live the game. I just wanted to drop it. I wanted to forfeit. I just wanted to stop. I just wanted to stop it. Because I was a different person who couldn't be understood. A person who's paralyzed, didn't know how to move until he was taught how to. With the same type of kids who were taught to. Lived there for a few years without my parents. It was torture for a few weeks, but I managed. I opened myself to a new world. Saw a new face and grabbed it like I was the only one who could have it. It changed my life, elevated me higher than before, like a bird I could soar, like monsters ink, I moved from door to door. In 2014, I moved on to New York to my parents' place, Qu lived there and took quite a lot of space. Couldn't get in with the private schools there, especially the Broadway area, so moved to the public area, which gave me a lot of benefits, especially hysteria. Yeah, especially hysteria. The camera on.